it's kind of pathetic you get all erratic about dirty dishes congesting the sink i'm tired of your bothers remember our fathers that dwelled in a world filled with rubbish and stink but when all hope was lost someone raised from the dust he was handsome and cunning his haircut had style courage was shining in his eyes as he said screw you guys mind your own business i'm off now goodbye Huzzah, he's off now goodbye Junk. Junk. And more junk. A life of order and happiness. Oh, my bad. That was junk, too. <sighs> well, that does it. I need to leave this dump. Fortunately, this time my plan is foolproof. This time everything will work out. Where did I put my list? Heck, I really have to get away from this junkyard. Ah, here's my list. Let's see. Seems like I've packed almost everything I need. All I need now are some provisions. The toothbrush, a pair of socks, and a bolt cutter. A bolt cutter? What the... Well, guess I must have had a reason to put it on the list. I won't have a use for this junk once I'm in Elysium. I should stick to the list. Another note from Tony. But what's she complaining about now? Will you please clean the bathroom for once? Yeah, right. In her dreams. What gnat hit? This doesn't have to be cleaned yet. That's what I've been telling Tony for months. Whoa. What the? The toothbrush bailed out on me. Guess I should have kept it in a more germ-free environment. Ah, the first aid kit. It saved my life several times, but since the time I tried to build a shrapnel-propelled jet, there's no band-aid left. The only thing in there now is Tony's tranquilizer. You're not supposed to eat on the sofa. I keep finding leftovers in it. Huh? Well, isn't that a good thing? The good old sofa. Too bad I can't fit it into my escape pod. I've had the most amazing ideas sitting here. Plus, you can always find leftovers in it. Hmm. Seems there are still some wasabi peas in there. But without something to put them into, nah, I'm not collecting them. Do the dishes already. They won't do themselves. Oh, yeah? Well, I'll take that chance. Blech. 
What Nat's pit? Ah, uh, I wonder if I can find some provisions for my journey here. You've scoffed all the food yet again, and I keep finding your crap in the fridge. What the hell's wrong with you? Huh? I don't understand the question. I'll have a quick look and see if I can find something useful in the pockets. Hey, there really was something in there. A sock. Cool. It can't be opened since the handle's gone. Tony was pissed off, but I needed it to secure the door of my matter transporter. I mean, the device was unstable enough without flies going in and out. Ouch! Hmm. Seems there are still some wasabi peas in there, but without something to put them into. Hmm. Seems there are still some wasabi peas in there, but I need a better container. The pot has no lid. They might end up rolling around in my inventory. Oh, cold. Burn the note. <laughs> Not a bad idea, but I need some more for the fire to really get going. This is Tony's room, the lion's den, or more aptly, the dragon's lair. Ah! Whoa, what's that? A guillotine so I won't enter her room? Whoa, that girl has issues. I honestly wonder why we were ever together at all. Stay out of my room. You have no business in there anymore. Who does Tony think she is? I've got better things to do than rummage through her drawers. In you go. I may not be an expert, but I'm sure I need a hot wash. But something's still missing. I may not be an expert, but I'm sure I need a hot wash. But something's still missing. The good old sofa. Too bad I can't fit it into my escape pod. I've had the most. Plus, you can always. Let's get rid of this thing. This doesn't have to be cleaned yet. That's what I've been telling Tony for months. Blech. What Nat's pit? 
Seems there are still some wasabi peas in there. <laughs> I guess these will make good provisions for the journey. Well, I think that's all. Should be enough. Uh, seems there are still some wasabi peas in there. But without something to put them into, nah, I'm not collecting them. I like my wasabi uncooked. It's a thing I have. Well, nothing to fork yet. If you don't do everything yourself, I may not be an expert, but I'm sure I need a hot wash. I wonder if I can find the second socket. Whoa, look at that! The sock changed color. Who would have thought it? But where's the other one? Clear case of subtractive color mixing. I'm not sticking my hand in there again! The mouse skedaddled long ago, which doesn't mean that its plan was better than mine. Provisions, check. One for now, and one for the road. Bolt cutter, for whatever reason, check. I should find the matching sock first. I don't want to show up in Elysium dressed like an idiot. The mouse skedaddled long ago, which doesn't mean that it's plan. I should use my provisions wisely. It'll be a long journey. It's mocking me. Yeah, would you just you wait? Mocking me, yeah? Would you just you wait? Now the little bugger's in for a surprise. Come on, brushy, brushy, brushy. Come to Papa. Ha! Gotcha! Ha! Gotcha! I'll make you suffer the next time I brush my teeth. Toot, 
scratch. Check. Enough with the laundry. I feel a rash coming on. The good old sofa. Too bad I can't fit it into my escape pod. The good old... Too bad I can't fit it into my escape pod. I've had the most amazing ideas sitting here. At least I already got one sock. But I need a pair. I don't want to show up in Olivia. All that's missing is a pair of socks. And Tony keeps complaining that I don't do enough housework. All my father left me, besides alone, was this stupid wooden trunk. Then he left Saponia, without me. My father left me a trunk, before he left me. I don't want to open it. I don't want to be disappointed yet again. What's this? A sock? That explains why I've had such cheesy dreams. Socks? Check. Ha! <laughs> Seems like I've packed everything. <laughs> oh, I can't close it anymore. Oh, seems like I've got to unpack something. But what? It doesn't take that much space. I'll never be able to close the suitcase with a monster like that in there. I mean, I won't need a bolt cutter where I'm going. I wonder why it was on the list in the first place. <laughs> now it fits. Packed and ready to go. <coughs> ah, I think I just strained something. <laughs> hey, Rufus. You should save your energy for the unavoidable drop into the abyss. Yeah, thanks, Wenzel. You can save your sarcasm for someone less well-prepared than me. This time, I took everything into account. It'll be a stroll in the park. Ah, that's what you said last time. It took us days to remove the cactus spikes from your butt, remember? That's all toxic runoff under the bridge. This time, everything will work out. And when finally an Elysian orbit pixie massages my back, I'll ask her to pause for a minute so I can laugh about you. Whatever. But say, can I have your stuff when you're gone? Yeah, sure. Help yourself. As if anything on this dump is valuable. Great. I hope you remember to calibrate the harpoon. I'll do that later, after I've stored everything in the pod. Well, then hurry up. <laughs> well, you know that the Organon are always on time. There. And now? There. Now where shall I put it? There we go. There. Now where shall I put it?
If I remove this seat, it might just fit, but how's it going to be attached? And more importantly, where shall I sit? I just got that from there. Hmm. I might be able to do without this. <laughs> New problem. <laughs> oh, crap. It's screwed tight. Hmm. I might be able to do without this. But how's it going to be attached? And more importantly, where shall I sit? That's where the seat was attached. I'll need some kind of replacement. This isn't much use now, I guess. There. But how's it going to be? It's and more importantly. And a center, my masterpiece. I've been working on this for so long. It must have been since Monday. I just need to prepare my escape pod for launch, adjust the harpoon, light the fuse, and then it's showtime. The escape pod is connected to that very powerful electromagnet via a long chain. Once the magnet is attached to the Organon cruiser, I can reel in the chain with a pedal-operated winch system and pull myself and the pod up. Then the cruiser will bring me directly to Elysium. This time, nothing can go wrong. There's nothing that needs to be screwed here. This isn't much use now, I guess. But how's it going to be attached? And more. I'll have to prepare the escape pod first. I want to be better prepared this time. This will be the most spec. This will be the most spectacular departure ever. There. Now where shall I put it? This isn't much use now, I guess. That's where the seat was attached. I'll need some kind of replacement.
Ha! There you go. Ha! There you go. There. The capsule is ready. Now, all I have to do is calibrate the harpoon. There. Too bad the two directions of the control stick are blocked, but who needs those anyway? The main thing is that the crosshairs are right on the tracks. And then I'm gone. <laughs> this will be a walk in the park. I did it! Now, I'll just light the fuse and boom! Well, that should be it. Stand by, Wenzel. Ah! Hello, Rufus. Tony, why are you sneaking around like that? This is still my house, remember? Well, it's not as obvious now since someone stole my mailbox. Oh, that reminds me. I'm supposed to give you this letter. A letter? Rufus, it's almost time. Yes, I know. Sorry, Tony, but it's over.
Once the fuse is lit, I'll be gone for good. If only that was true. I bet now you're sorry about some of the things you said. That's right. Starting with, you can stay with me. This is the final goodbye. It's too early to jump for joy, I fear. There's nothing you could say to prevent me from going. What a stroke of luck. That means I can't say anything wrong. No, it's too late. You can beg all you want, but I won't take you along with me. Can I have that in writing? Why are you here? Are you still hoping for a miracle? It would be a miracle if you finally disappeared for real. But in case it doesn't work out again, I'll at least have the satisfaction of seeing you injure yourself. I'm leaving. For good. I gave up hope of that a long time ago. Now is when it counts. Hullabaloo. Ah, well, maybe I should read the letter. Dear Mr. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bridger, we are happy to inform you, blah, blah, blah. Get to the point, will ya? Unfortunately, the delivery of your screws will be delayed for... Please find enclosed a voucher for a pack of rivets. We apologize for any inconvenience this might have caused. Sincerely yours. Just a second. Screws? Ooh, what a maneuver. Hey, my suitcase is here too. It must have got entangled in the chain. <laughs> Just like I planned. <laughs> 